Kaduri Zara, please help me study. One day, a beautiful girl came up to me, Kaisuke Kariyazawa. To be clear, we've never talked before, but I know who she is. Her name's Fuka Katihaya, and we're both second year students. She's in the track and field club and the fastest runner in the prefecture. Add her looks to the package, and she's a school celebrity. I must have heard wrong. Uh, did you just ask me to tutor you? That's right. You sure? My test scores are always average, you know. I think you'd be better off asking a straight-A student. But Miss Kaduizawa told me you'd be a good tutor. Oh, did she now? As you might guess from our names, Miss Kaduizawa is my sister. That must mean Kazuhaya is one of her students. Mm, no thanks. Huh? But why? I'm too busy, and like I said, shouldn't you be asking the straight-A students? But... But you scored 180 on your IQ to... You can stop there. Mm. Uh, what are you doing? That's what I want to ask. Come with me for now. Why? What is it? She's flustered, but I grabbed her hand and pulled her out to the hallway. There are just too many people in the classroom. My sister told you my IQ? Yep. You hold yourself back on tests, but you're actually super smart. That's why she told me to ask you for your help. Not so loud! I don't want other people to hail you. Why not? Isn't it great that you're so smart? You should be more proud of yourself. I don't want to be proud of it, and I don't want people to know. Wow, you're such a weirdo. Ah! This whole thing rubs me the wrong way, so I don't want to help. But why not? I'm not asking for anything bad. Now you're really getting on my nerves. Ask someone else to help you study. I'm not good at teaching others. Please, wait! Please don't abandon me! Don't grab me! I I'm not abandoning you! But you said you won't help me! You can't say that you've been abandoned. I haven't tried to help you at all yet! Don't be like that. Please, tutor me! Ah, why the sudden urge to study anyway? I have to pass the test to get into the university I want to attend. You have to help me! Oh, then go to cram school or get a tutor or something. That's what I've been doing for these past two years. But it isn't working! If they can't even help you, how am I supposed to help? <laughs> Whoa! I'm not trying to push you away on purpose or anything. I just think it'd be better if you found someone who knows what they're doing. But <laughs> you said I was getting on your nerves. I didn't really mean it. <laughs> I thought this might happen. Who? Sis? I told you to call me Miss Kaduizawa when we're in school. Anyways, looks like you've got your hands full. Don't laugh like this has nothing to do with you! You're the one who sent you to me! Oh, calm down. I just thought this would be good for both of you. What's even in this for me? How about learning how to be sociable from her? She's got great social skills, you know. I don't really care about getting along with anyone, though. That's exactly what I'm talking about. But first of all, try giving her a hand. Not like you'll be studying for any tests next year, right? Then why don't you help her? You are her teacher. I'm going to mind my own business. You sure you want that? But what's that supposed to mean? You remodeled your room all on your own. If you don't mind me digging into your secret stash and showing it to mom and dad, go ahead back to the classroom. How do you know about that? Did you really think you could hide anything from your big sis? You're the one who bars into my room while I wasn't there. Oh, whatever. I'm just checking to see if you'll tutor Kazehaya or not. Ugh, fine. That's more like it. Thank you, Katarizawa. Oh, I'm so glad to hear that. Don't thank me. She didn't leave me any other choice. But still, you're tutoring me. This is great. Thank you. Sure. Look at you. You don't seem that unhappy about it. Don't tease me. It's not funny. Uh-huh, sure. Well, I won't get in your way anymore. Shut up! Oh, 
Oh, Kazehaya. You can come over to our house to study. Keisuke will take you home, so don't worry about that. <laughs> don't I get a say in this? Oh, relax. Anyway, have fun. My sister said what she wanted and walked away. I can't believe her. You really get along with your sister. How did any of that look like getting along to you? Huh? That's just how it looks to me. I can't see how siblings arguing can look like they're getting along. Does your interpretation of events change when you're a sociable person? I file away these thoughts for later and refocus on what to do now. Anyway, if I put my mind to something, I'm going to do it right. But if I'm not motivated or anything, I'm done. Got it? Loud and clear. I'll work extra hard. I'll help you until your test then. Although, your focus is track and field, isn't it? Do you even have time to study? My plan is to come home from practice, take a bath, and go straight to studying. That sounds really stressful. Gotta do what I gotta do to pass the test. Well, if you're that motivated. All right, then. Can you call me when you're about to leave? I don't know where you live, but I'll come get you from the station. Oh, I couldn't ask you to do that. Just to be safe. My sister would agree that it's risky to go alone at night. And I wouldn't be surprised if you had a stalker or something. <laughs> What's so funny? You're really nice, you know that? Don't be ridiculous! Anyway, we should get back. Class is about to start. Okie dokie, let's walk back together. I guess we're going in the same direction. And I was thinking, isn't it a little weird for us to be so formal with each other? Not really, not to me. Come on, admit it's a pain. I'm gonna call you Keisuke. Ugh, socialites. Please don't use my first name. Hm. You don't have to be so aloof, you know. It's not that. I don't want anyone to notice. I'll get nasty side eyes if we're on a first name basis. You're worrying too much. Why are you so against being noticed? Some people just aren't good with receiving attention. Huh. If you say so, then how about if no one else is around? If I say no? Then I guess if you really had a good reason. If we made it situational, you might slip up without realizing it, so no. Hmm, your logic's weak. I'm really good at reading the situation, you know. Then I'll say no because it's embarrassing. Ha, you weren't embarrassed when I said your name just now, so I'm not buying that. <laughs> You're more annoying than you look. I don't think you should be saying that to someone's face. Sorry, I'm just blunt like that. Wow. What now? I think blunt people are great. Ah! What's with this girl? I was sure she would throw that right back at me. Is this what the embodiment of sociability is like? I was completely shaken by her response. Optimistic social people are scary. Afterward, we both returned to our respective classrooms. That night. Keisuke, thanks for coming to get me. No problem. You sure you're not too tired? I just took a bath, so I feel great. It's chilly at night. Be careful. It'll be fine. My energy's my greatest strength. Besides, they say that idiots don't catch colds. You shouldn't say that about yourself. She has a bright personality, but I think she has a screw or two loose. Once we got to my place, I took her up to my room. Come to think of it, uh, what are your grades like? Not far from the bottom. M meaning? All Fs. That's nothing to be proud of. <gasps> d d don't get mad at me. I'm just being honest with you. I don't care about that. You, how have you been studying at all? I have been. Then how are you grades this bad? I don't get what the teachers are saying. So what else am I supposed to do? <sighs> Don't sigh at me. Not like I wanted to. If you're failing tests because you don't get what's going on in class, do you know what that means? Uh, uh, what does that mean? It means you don't understand the fundamentals. That's where we'll have to start. It's bad enough we'll have to start from junior high. This is going to take time. 
now that you mention it, I started neglecting my grades to focus on running during junior high. Well, what's done is done. What's the computer for? I'm gonna make some simple problems. This is so I can see what you already know. You can do that? Writing your problems isn't that hard, but it'll take me a while to do this for every subject. I don't want to waste your time, so we're only going to work on math tonight. I'll write something for the other subjects later. Thanks! I printed the questions out and gave them to Kazuhaya to solve. Meanwhile, I wrote more questions and gave them to her as she finished. Afterward, I looked at her answers and determined where her level was. Well, I get it, more or less. Really? H how is it? We'll have to build up from elementary school. Oh no, is it that bad? You could always go to a university, they'll take you on a sports scholarship. No, I don't want to give up. Hmm. Why are you so set on this? Where are you trying to get into? Kanon Yuki University. An elite school renowned for academics and athletics, huh? It'd be a lot easier to get hired by a major company if you graduated from there. I hear alumni keep an eye on promising graduates and make it easier for them to pursue their careers. If I could get into a good company, I want to make my mom's life easier. At home, it's always just been the two of us. Oh. I guess you have a lot of studying to do, huh? You're not going to tell me it's impossible? You can't say it's impossible until you've done everything you could, right? And you can't give up before you've even started. <gasps> Thank you, Kesuke. Actually, other teachers and tutors gave up on me because they thought it'd be impossible. I'm so relieved to hear you say that. Save it until after you pass. No point in thanking me if we can't make that happen. Oh, you're right. I'll work really hard. And so, after that, I tutored Kazuhaya every night. She really wanted to get into KYU. So she was very concentrated on studying. Since we had to restart from the beginning with her, her score on the actual test won't be that high. But she's definitely improving. It's now been half a year since we started our study sessions. Is... is it really possible for me? This is the first time I've heard her feel defeated. Since you've gotten the fundamentals down, your grades have gone up, haven't they? But the questions on QYU's test are going to be even harder. Well, you're not wrong. I knew it. This was impossible from the start. No, it's not. Besides, it's not like you're trying to get the best score on the test. What? You're not trying to get the best score. You're just trying to pass and get in, right? Uh, right. Then don't worry about scores or ranks. How about you try solving these problems? What's this? I looked at KYU's past entrance exams to find trends in the questions as best I could and made them for you. It's not foolproof, but considering how little time there is left, I think you'll have a much better shot of passing if you focus on that. You did all this? I'm here to help you pass, after all. I'm just doing what I have to do to make that happen. I love you! Kazuhaya? What's gotten into you? I'm just so happy you've done this for me! And you've been so kind and dedicated in helping me study! I love you so much! Y you can't just say that to a guy, you know! They could get the wrong idea! But I mean it! I love you! I love you, Keisuke! Uh, are you serious? Absolutely! I want to go out with you! Hold on, slow down! This is happening too fast for me! In that case, if I pass the test, please, kiss me! How'd she jump to that? S sorry I meant, uh, please go out with me if I pass. Is that okay? Well, okay. Let's go out if you pass. I'd be a total liar if I said I wasn't into Gazihaya. She is really cute after all. And we've been together every day for the past six months, so of course I'd fall for her. Do you mean it? Oh my gosh! Don't hug me so suddenly! I'm not used to this! But I'm just so happy! Why don't we just start going out right now? Jeez, make up your mind! In the end, I promised to kiss her if she passed the test. And we started going out as of that night. 
Also, because of her intense desire to pass, I decided I wanted to go to KYU with her. And now is the day the results come out. Uh, I'm... I'm scared to look. It'll be fine. You studied hard for this. Y you're right. You made those practice questions for me. So I must have scored well enough. Let's see. My number's 293, and yours is 292. <gasps> I, I found them! I found both of our names, Keisuke! I see them too. Congratulations, Fuka! Thank you! Congratulations to you too, Keisuke! This is all thanks to you! Oh, Keisuke, thank you so, so much! I'm the one who should be thanking you, Fuka. In my hometown, people called me a genius when I was small, and greedy adults took advantage of that. And jealous classmates would glare at me and refuse to do anything with me. But thanks to Fuka's kindness, I'm more comfortable interacting with others now. This is all thanks to her. Let's go home. Okay, and don't forget to keep your promise. My... right. I thought you forgot about the kiss, but I guess not. So we went home. Kiske? Yeah? Stay with me, okay? I love you. She passed the test, so I made sure to keep my promise.